Having a dynamic range of texture details can be quite handy, especially when working with painterly assets where low details are important for faraway objects. This effect can be achieved thanks to this little camera data node, which can act like a mist pass, plugging either the view depth set or view distance socket into a map range node and playing with the from max value can give you better control. The map range also allows you to invert the resulting values by swapping the zero and one from the two mean and max values. In this case, I also added a color ramp set to ease to blend the values a bit more. This is going to be used as a black and white factor value in a mixed color node. Inverting the values is just a preference. It'll only affect the order in which the textures have to be plugged to get the desired effect. All that's left to do is to plug your textures in the mix node. If you're using normal, roughness, metallic, and other maps, you may need one mix node per map. And if you want more control on where the details appear, you can always multiply your camera distance mask with other masks.